You know, faith and fear don't go together. So don't try putting them together. You are either walking in faith or in fear. And that's the word for the day. Isolate your faith from fear and just walk and keep walking in faith. I take you to Numbers chapter 13. Moses sent out 12 spies to go and inspect the land, to go and scout the land that God had decided to give to them. 10 of them came back with a very interesting report. They began by telling about the great things that were in the land, the milk and the honey flowing in the land. They brought grapes to show the grapes were huge and large. And then in the very next breath, they began to describe the terror in the land. They said the people are large. They said the cities are fortified. They said the people are powerful. To what end? To suggest that for that reason, they could not take the land. So on one hand, they were walking in faith and talking about how great the land was. And in the other hand, they were talking about how terrible and how fierce the land and the people are. In fact, at some point they said the land devours its own people, which was not true because people were living in the land. Friend, God has called you to walk by faith. You cannot mix faith and fear. Whatever situation you're navigating, you must be single-minded and make a determination to only walk by faith. That's the word for the day. I'm Pastor Frederick Madison from Rima International Bible Church in Silver Spring, Maryland. We are people of faith. We walk by faith. I invite you to join us when we gather on Sunday for worship at 11.30. Otherwise, continue following us on our social media platforms, YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram. And please help us publish this word of faith around the world. God bless you. God willing. I'll be back again with another word for the day.